Okay, so if you want to do variations, obviously you've got to go to sell. Sometimes it tells you to select single listing, but on this one it just says sell for three. You have to select single single listing, not multiple. So, Nike, because not all categories have variations. So, put Nike Air, and we'll just use sizes as the variation. So, it's going to continue without match. New box. But sometimes if variations are like showing, you can click there and go into your settings and find it variations there on off. So your variations is on. We're just gonna go straight down it and just do that. So click on edit. So it's got loads of attributes already on there. So pretend that's clear, I'm just gonna add one. I'm going to put UK shoe size. Save. We click on it. And then we're going to select create your own. Because usually when I'm doing it, you're having to create your own. So I'll create my own. Big. Sorry, my G's gone on this keyboard. So. Big I refuse to buy anyone. Add so it's under UK shoe size, which I selected or created. And big, we'll add another one medium, create another one large, got no G. So I'll work with that, G. So add, and then you press continue. So you come down here, you got big, medium, and large. You can add a photo. So you've added your photos. Let's just say it's different night trainers, different sizes, or different toys, whatever. You can then add the EAM number or put does not apply. Obviously, you've got your big, your medium. Then you can select your quantities and then add your price for each. And that's it, it's easy. You just save and close. There you go, prices from 0 0.99 to 2.99. Big, medium, large. Easy.